The Glorious Equilibrium and the Big Bang All explosions cause damage to an already existing order and their effects are always destructive. There's only one explosion to which this does not apply. The Big Bang The Big Bang Theory states that the universe came into being with a single enormous explosion. Under normal circumstances, explosions fling matter outward and disorder it. Yet the Big Bang has a completely opposite effect. It caused pieces of matter to combine together and give rise to whole galaxies. The matter that came into being with the Big Bang acquired an extraordinary form and regularity. In the wake of that explosion, planets, galaxies and stars all formed in a flawless manner. The flawless order and equilibrium in the Big Bang, which has been proved with modern scientific findings, definitely prove that the universe was created by Allah, the Almighty. I seek refuge in Allah from the accursed Satan. He, Allah, is the originator of the heavens and the earth. One dimension of the stunningly delicate order in the Big Bang is its speed. The speed of the expansion of the universe was determined with an extraordinary sensitivity, calculated and set into motion perfection. The speed of the expansion of the universe is so critical that if it had been less than 1 in 100 million parts slower in the first second after the Big Bang, the universe would have imploded without ever reaching its present state. If the universe had expanded just a little faster after the Big Bang, all existing matter would have been simply scattered around and disappeared. If the speed of the explosion had been just one part in 10 to the minus 18 power different, this would have been enough to destroy the entire equilibrium. If the density of the universe had been just slightly greater, then the universe could not have expanded at all and would have again have contracted back to a single point. If the density had been slightly less, then the universe would have expanded at top speed, in which case atomic particles would fail to attract and bind to one another, and the stars and galaxies would never have formed. These sensitive balances, a flawless universe, the systems within that universe, the stars, the earth, and all the people, trees, animals, flowers and other living things on earth could not have come about by the spontaneous combination of atoms in the wake of a random explosion. All the details we see wherever we look are evidence of the existence and power of Almighty Allah. Science proves creation. Allah definitely exists. He is the sole lord of the skies, the earth and the wondrous equilibrium in the universe. Allah created the universe from nothing. This conclusion reached by modern science was foretold in the Quran 1400 years ago. I seek refuge in Allah from the accursed Satan. Your lord is Allah who created the heavens and the earth in six days and then settled himself firmly on the throne. He covers the day with the night, each pursuing the other urgently, and the sun and moon and stars are subservient to his command. Both creation and command belong to him. Blessed be Allah, the Lord of all the worlds.